so if you want pdf of uh, this particular lesson or any of my lesson right you can contact me on facebook id and the link will be given below in the info section the first question is uh, it is asked in gs uh, 2 paper in 2016 and uh, the limit is 2000 uh, sorry 200 words for uh, 12 and a half marks so the question is did the government of india act 1935 lay down a federal constitution discuss so very straightforward question right not uh, they don't ask you to connect something with something right so you can write the answer in the comments below and I will give the answer in the next lesson and this question is in uh, prelims 2007 IAS and there are two statements right according to Wevel plan the number of Hindu and Muslim in the executive council were to be equal and the second statement is Powell thought that this arrangement would have avoided the partition of India right I once again repeat that I am not giving you the answers I am just giving you a glimpse on the type of questions you should ex expect in the exam right so commit your answer right and uh, this question is asked in UPPCS 2008 and uh, the question is the constitution of india provides for all necessities of the country yes and it is known as uh, or called as adopted constitution this is also right but you have to tell both are individually true and r is correct you have to tell whether r is a correct explanation of a or not right so to make a comment on that too now this question is asked in uh, prelims 2009 the discussion in the third round table conference eventually led to the passing of government of india act 1935 Yes, the Government of India Act uh, 1935 provided for the establishment of an all Indian federation to be based on Union of British Provinces and Princely States, right? And then, okay, so I'm giving answer here because, uh, okay, when you when you study this chapter, right, historical background, either from uh, polity or from history, yeah, you can refer a spectrum for history. So, <clears throat> what do you study? You study how many members are in the constituent assembly, or uh, how how much seat are allocated allo located to the British provinces, or how much to the princely states, or how many Congress, how many seats Congress won, and how many seats uh, Muslim League won. You focus on that. But the question here is, how many women members were there in the Indian Constituent Assembly, right? The options are 15, 13, 12 and 10 and the correct answer is A. So, you know, this is, uh, you know, out of the blues point and you have to focus on these things also. So, meet you in the next lesson. Thanks.